Hey, today I'm going to do a quick review on Russian-made steel-cased ammunition. I've had guys ask me about this stuff in the past, and we're going to do something a little different today with it, though. We're going to shoot it through uh, two different AR-15 pistols and see how this stuff works. So, real quickly, what we're going to do is, my friend Mike, he's going to be here in just a moment, he's got a, an AR-15 pistol, and you'll notice this gun looks a lot like a traditional AR-15, except, of course, it has a short barrel on it. Now, the gun I'm going to shoot today is this Carbon 15 made by Bushmaster. Now, this is an older design, so they don't look like this anymore. But uh, you notice it has a short gas tube on it. Same with Mike. So we just want to check this ammo and see uh, how well it's going to work in these pistols. And my gas system is not adjustable. The system on Mike's rifle or pistol is adjustable. You notice on this gun here, the upper receiver, lower receiver, and the buffer tube are made out of polymer. And it has a seven and a quarter inch stainless fluted barrel. And it has a, the, uh, it has a, a detachable muzzle brake on it. Now both of these guns do take a standard AR-15 magazine and they both shoot uh, 5.56 or in this case this will also shoot 223. So what we're going to shoot today is this Tula 55 grain full metal jacket. I've got some Wolf 62 grain full metal jacket and I've got some Wolf military classic 62 grain hollow point. Now the Wolf and the Tula that's a probably the most popular Russian brands here in the USA so let's uh, get over to the range put some rounds through these two guns and uh, see how well they work hi everybody um, you'll have to excuse my uh, jacked up voice I'm uh, a little sick but anyway we got uh, my particular AR pistol this guy right here I built myself from, uh, from scratch we've got an Anderson uh, lower we've got about a seven inch barrel on this thing uh, pretty basic stuff actually Yankee Hill machining hand guard on here but the big the big thing is the uh, SB 15 stabilizing brace with the KAK Industries uh, buffer tube which is uh, super rad that thing's extremely loud and uh, has a pretty pretty good amount of recoil but um, I like the thing so um, we're going to go shoot this guy. Mike, tell me about this SIG stock you got. This guy right here, um, this is uh, the stock that's not a stock. What this is, is a stabilizing brace. The intended use of which is to get my arm through and to stabilize the thing, you know, for you should do it for the hip or whatever. Well, that's pretty cool. Yeah, and it's, uh, it's a neat idea. The ATF has classified it as a stabilizing brace, not a stock. So when you put it on an AI pistol, your pistol remains a pistol. And this is made by SIG? Yeah. And it's made in the USA, correct? That's correct. You know, nice. It, it helps control recoil quite a bit, and I can actually shoulder the weapon and treat it like a short-barreled rifle or treat it like a regular rifle, and everything's all right. Yeah, that does look pretty cool. I will have to shoot that later. Yes, it's, uh, it's a real, uh, real different weapon to shoot. The, real, the extremely short barrel, I basically just wanted as short a barrel as I could get um, for home defense reasons. And um, it, it's just really nice and it moves from target to target really easy. Now, this is classified as a handgun and not a rifle, that's correct? That's correct. This is a handgun. Uh, that's part of why I don't have a vertical foregrip on it and will never have a vertical foregrip.
Oh, simple. Okay. Put the fear of God in him, that's for sure. Well, Mike, I think I'll try out your gun and uh, see how it shoots. Well, that's nice. I like that. A little more controllable than my little pistol. Kind of like a short rifle. All right. Nice gun you got, Mike. Thank you. If you're looking for some cheap ammo for your AR-15 pistol, check out the Tula and Wolf ammo because you know what? For the price, it's really good ammo. It's starting to rain out here, so thanks for watching my video. We'll see you guys next time. Yeah! Well, everyone, thanks for uh, watching the video. And I uh, hope you guys enjoy our little, uh, our little toys here. And just remember, you know, like, share, and subscribe.